So here at the, at the Metropolitan Sewer District of Greater Cincinnati, we manage nine wastewater treatment plants. We treat on average about 180 million gallons a day across all those wastewater treatment plants. We have a number of industrial users across our footprint that we regulated by uh, spot checking and sampling uh, at, at, at random times. We didn't really have a great idea of what was continuously coming into our collection system. And that, that can be a problem because you have issues where if you don't know what's being introduced in your collection system, you can have problems with uh, infrastructure protection where your sewers are breaking down over time. It can cause issues in your plants with upsets if you're sending things that are really high strength that kill off your biology of the plant. Uh, so we started looking for technologies to uh, help us understand what we didn't know. The Condu Pulse solution is a way to understand how your collection system behaves, whether it be through measurement of water quality or whether it be through how your communities are influencing what goes on in that wastewater. On the, uh, the Pulse Solution side, we have eight different sensors that we use now and move around selectively uh, to collect information in different portions of our collection system. But through the health department's work, uh, we've deployed 16 more fixed sites. So we're collecting both community health information and wastewater quality information at these sites. We're, we're actually finding great overlaps between these sites in where we are learning about industrial users in that area in our collection system that we've isolated that we didn't know about before. I can see in real time how a, a section of sewer is behaving, you know. For us in public health, um, you know, our job is to alert the community um, of when there is an abnormality, when there is risk um, of, of outbreaks and, and risk to the community. And so the wastewater data and looking at the wastewater analysis over time um, is one of those ways that we can do that and help alert the community if we see any abnormal trends, something that we see out of the norm. Um, and I think where Kendu's help to come in is identify where we can find more targeted areas where um, we can determine detection at a more granular level than we have in the past. Um, and I think that that could, you know, in the future help um, help with public health and, uh, you know, and just general community knowledge and that greater situational awareness that we'd like to have for surveillance of communicable diseases.